Hello and welcome to the first of three videos on installing operating systems. This video is brought to you by Cavtech Systems Limited. After you have appropriately configured your BIOS and opted to boot from the DVD-ROM, you'll be brought to this screen where you can choose both the time and regional formats in which you want your operating system to be installed. Once you have set the regional and location defaults, you'll be able to proceed with the installation. Depending on which version of Microsoft Windows that you are installing, you will first have to select either 64-bit or a 32-bit operating system. We will then need to accept the license terms and conditions and then proceed with the installation. It's always best if you're doing a fresh install just to make sure that your hard drive is correctly formatted and partitioned. The installation will then begin. This part of the installation will take several minutes depending on the configuration and components of your PC. Once the initial stage is completed, just restart your PC. Your PC will restart again after the installation has completed. After the second restart, we will be brought to this screen where we can now enter our username and passwords. The following screen will bring us to where we can enter the Windows product key and to be able to activate Windows when we are next online. To help keep our Windows PC safe and protected and up to date, Windows has allowed us to automate a few processes namely that of Windows updates, helping to improve Windows and to make internet browsing safer. It is recommended that we use the top option there, use recommended settings. Here we will be able to set the exact date and time if it isn't already correct. The following screen will allow us to connect to our local Wi-Fi that will allow us to update and download any appropriate software to complete the installation. And finally, Windows will finalize and confirm all of your settings, allowing you to go to the desktop to finish the installation of Windows. Now that the installation of Windows is complete and that you're in your desktop environment, now it's all about making sure that your PC is up to date, protected and loaded with all the necessary and your preferential applications. We highly recommend that you do your Windows updates before anything else. Make sure that you have every last little one that is necessary and required for your PC. After the installation is complete, you'll be brought to the desktop. Here you can install any motherboard and graphics drivers and then download and install any additional Windows updates and any other additional software that you may require. During the downloading and installation of the Windows updates, I like to also download and install various other applications that I like to have. If you go to www.nanite.com, you'll find a huge library of free and software that you'll be able to download and use. This includes media applications, imaging software, office softwares, security, and various other utilities, all here free to use. Select the ones you want, and then click Get Installer. Nanite is a one-click install, that means you'll download and install all these applications without any fuss and without any bloatware. 